I've always found it fascinating that an AI model is just a file of numbers. This is until you give it an address on the internet. So what if I told you we could deploy a cutting edge language model with GPU acceleration, completely serverless and ready to scale globally. And the best part, it's all with just a few commands on Google Cloud. In this three-part video series, I wanna show you how simple it is to deploy your own open source model, which you can then use as the brain of your AI agent. So you're probably wondering, why would we not just use pre-existing models available to us when we build our ADK agent? Deploying a separate decoupled LLM allows us to scale it independently. Additionally, it gives us the option to fine tune a more specific model targeted towards certain use cases. An example of this could be fine tuning an LLM to be a specialist on all of the information about your zoo so that with this new fine tuned LLM, it can act as a zoo tour guide, helping to answer questions about the resident zoo animals. So in this video, we'll be kicking off by tackling the brain of any AI agent, which is the model. We're going to take an open source model, Gemma, and deploy it as a scalable GPU accelerated service using Google Cloud Run. We'll start by building the first part of our two-part system, which will be a dedicated service just for running the open model. This is our brain. It's separate so we can scale it independently. And because this service will use GPU resources, which is a little bit more costly than CPU resources, scaling it independently will be beneficial. We'll use Olama to serve Gemma. The magic happens in the Docker file, so let's break it down. Olama is an LLM serving framework, which will allow us to easily serve our open model. First, we start from the official Olama image. Olama offers a variety of open models, and in this series, we'll be using Google's new tiny Gemma model, Gemma 3 270M. This tiny model is compact with only 270 million parameters. It's energy efficient, it's instruction tuned, and has production ready quantization baked right in. This makes it perfect for handling isolated tasks while keeping costs reasonably low. Next, we set a few environment variables. Olama host tells it to accept requests from anywhere, not just your local machine. Olama keep alive is a key optimization. It tells Olama to never unload the model from the GPU's memory, which makes subsequent requests way faster. Finally, the most important part is the run command, run Olama pull model. This command bakes the model's weights directly into our container's image. This means that when a new instance starts up, the model is already there, slashing our cold start times. But now for the fun part, deploying it with one command. It looks long, but let's focus on the flags that matter the most. I've included links to all the relevant documentation to learn more about the entire command in the description of this video. GCloud run deploy Olama Gemma 3 270M GPU. That's our service name. GPU one and GPU type. This is where we request our hardware. We're asking for one NVIDIA L4 GPU. The L4 is a beast for inference. It's fast and cost effective. Memory 16 gigabyte and CPU eight. We need enough system memory and CPU to support the GPU and handle the data flowing in and out. Concurrency four. This is a crucial performance knob. It means each instance of our service will handle up to four requests at the same time. This keeps the GPU busy and maximizes throughput. And finally, max instances three. We're setting a cap on how many instances can spin up so we can control our costs. We don't want a surprise build. So we'll hit enter and Google Cloud Build will take our Docker file, build the image and deploy it to Cloud Run. This can take about five minutes because it's downloading the model and provisioning a GPU. And we're live. The command finished and gave us a URL. So let's save that URL to an environment variable because we're gonna need it in the next video. So what did we just do? We deployed a powerful open source language model on a serverless platform with a dedicated GPU hardware. It's ready to scale and serve requests from anywhere in the world. We built the brain, but it can't talk to anyone just yet. In the next video, we'll build the face of our application, an ADK agent, and connect it to our new GPU powered backend. Bye for now.